hi engineers in this video we will be looking into the progressing and pie chart of this react native chart kit library progressing can be used to compare activities of a user suppose a user can have different activities like swim bike run so if the user has done this comparisons he can easily visualize this in this progressing component i have a example of this progressing in this apple watch activity so here we find this similar kind of graph like the user has done the red colored activity the most after that the green and after that this light blue so we can use progressing to have this data the pie chart also allows us to visualize data in a circle but in case of by chart we will be having a single circle and there will be divisions in that circle so the red colored data of this progressing will have the maximum share so let's get started in the previous video we have seen the contribution graph for this progressing i will create a similar demo file and add it to this app.tsx Now I will first copy paste some of the code from the library github repo and then I will explain it. So now I will be explaining the code written. So we can find here that almost it is similar to other components like the line chart and the bar chart where the, there is a data. This data is a object. There is two keys labels and data. So this labels is the activities like swim, run, bike and the data are the corresponding values. The maximum value will be one to signify the full circle. The width is the screen width and height is our height needed. Stroke width is the width of this each circle. Suppose if we give here 8, then our circle will be thinner. Radius is the width of this circle. So if we make it 20, then our circle will be smaller. And now the chart config is similar to what we have seen in other components like color transition from the bottom left to the top right so it is going from white to light green and the color here is we don't specifically need the color here but if we don't provide it then it will be an error it is some library dependency but we are not actually using it now the props for labels is the what are the props for this level like swim, bike, run? If we give it red, sorry, it will be smaller red. If we give it red, then it becomes this red colored and also we can have a font size. So 
so this font size increases and there is this legend where whether we need the legend or not so by default it, it is hide legend is false so that's why it is showing now let's add some props to enhance this ui so currently we see that all the progressing have this common white color we can modify this so that every circle has its own color for that we have to add a color property in this data where we can give the individual colors of this circle so we can give colors like red green and yellow now this colors will not impact this ui because we have to also add a prop with custom bar color from data so it tells whether we will take the color from this data so if you make it true then we see that these are the colors so now it looks good so this concludes the progress chart and its props now let's look into the pie chart I will create a new component pie chart demo and add it to the app.tsx. Once again, I will first write some code taken from this library example and will explain them after writing. To explain the props, the data is the data which will be shown. Here, the structure of the data is an array of objects, each has these five properties name, population, color, legend, font color, and legend font size. Name which will be shown in the legend, like this seal, the name of the countries. Population, this is the value. Here, population is, is in the data, and this accessor prop will determine which field it will take when calculating so we have to mention it here population now the color is the color of this individual pies and the legend circle legend font color and font size is for this text so if we give the first one of black then it will be black and if we give it suppose 20 then its font size will increase so in this way we can modify this now one thing to note here is it is mandatory to pass two props background color and padding left unlike other chart components of this library the background color is a prop outside the chart config so if we see in this progress chart we see that the background color is a this properties like background gradient from and background gradient to but in this pie chart this is a fixed so we have to give a background color outside this chart config so if we make it red then we will be red colored let's do it transparent also we have to mention the padding left we can increase or to decrease it according to our need now if we want the legend value to show absolute values instead of percentage so currently we see that takes 47% of this pie Toronto takes 
if we want to show the actual absolute population then we have to show the absolute to true this will show the absolute values now the padding is a bit cut now so we have to adjust the padding so that it becomes zero now it is uh, properly shown so this is an issue with this library i guess you got the idea of how to use this so that's it for this video if you like this content please like this video and subscribe to this channel